who we introducing. Here's my cousin Keisha, and she has a lot of cash. And she paid me $50 to see me whip DJ T-Rex ass. At the family reunion, who we introducing, who we introducing. Mr. Kenny. Yes, Bob. How you doing, man? Um, I think this will fall under the geography subject, okay? <clears throat> All right. So the oldest living tree is 4,843 years old, right? Okay. Now the oldest cast member in Godfrey is 152 <laughs> years old, right? So we all know what Godfrey old ass is. He right there. You know what I mean? Dying. Uh, and where is this tree located, though? All right. Uh, well, first off, <laughs> I would challenge uh, Godfrey being the oldest cast member and say it's DJ D Rex old ass. No, no, uh, no. no. But I'm gonna give you the no. answer to your question. It's gonna be California, where old ass D Rex is from. Hey, hey, <laughs> good trees, old trees. That's where they at, baby. That's where they, they, they got the best uh, trees. Boy, uh, well, you know something. Hey, now. Settle class, we have a long day today. Welcome to Science Studies Mathematics Reading Class 101, okay? Now, as you can see, I have this globe here. Mr. Nicholas Cannon, how are you, buddy? Good, I'm good. Scholar, how are you? Scholar. Uh, this question should be very easy for you. The width of the Earth is approximately 12.742 million meters. There is only one other sphere that is greater than or equal to the size of the Earth. Is that sphere A, Mars, B, Jupiter, C, Saturn, or D, J.D. Rex head. You know what? That's a tough one. I'm gonna have to go with D.J. D. Rex head. And you are correct, Mr. Nicholas Carter. Thank you. <laughs> baby dad, baby mama, baby dad, baby mama, baby dad. Hey yo, who wants the drama? D.J. D. Rex baby mama is so old. <laughs> How old is she? <laughs> when she left the museum, the alarm went off. Oh. Because he said, like, she was an exhibit in the museum. I understood what he like, was saying. Was prehistoric. It just wasn't funny. Look, I'm really sorry, but this relationship, it's kind of like DJ d -Rec in between seasons of Wild and Out. It's just not working at all. That's not true. You That's, that's not true at all. Tiger, you, I know I, I ain't with the boy, man. Hold on, hold on. We had this conversation. Tiger and d rex they really wasn't feeling the bull. They said they like, they too masculine for this. And d rex over there making us fall, giving us all these hard-ass words. I think we want to see you ride this damn bull. Why you bull spitting? Why you bull spitting? Why you bull spitting? Why you bull spitting? Here we go. Why you bull spitting? What? <laughs> Awful. Y'all give it up for DJ D Rex. Do that idiot boy. You. 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 It's kind of dope though. You. You. Do the jerk. Y'all can, can do better that. than that. Y'all can, can do body better that. than that. Watch this, you Y'all can do better than that. Eat that ass up. Eat that ass up. Eat that ass up. Eat that ass up. Wait, 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 wait. Can we cancel clearly the bell button? Because you're giving everything a bell when it's what? Can we cancel you? Can we cancel your, your mom for having you? Can we cancel God for even thinking of you? Can we cancel anything that has anything to do with DJ Ray? Or else I want to cancel my damn self for so being this close to you. Can I cancel me for being close to you? Can I cancel anything that has anything to do with DJ who right? Creeping in the dark. I was creeping through the dark, and what did I find? I saw an out of work DJ out of his prime. <laughs> creeping in the dark. I really <laughs> 
Creeping in the dark. Creeping in the dark. Your scene is the Stone Age. What's up, bro? No, I'm at the hospital. DJ D Rex was born at. There's a hater in the house. Should I get him? Let's get him. There's a hater in the house. Should I get him? Let's get him. I guess I'll pop it out, cameraman. Can you pop go ahead and uh, please? I want the camera on the biggest hater uh, of me, uh, DJ D Rex. Put the camera Ooh. on DJ D Rex. <laughs> <laughs> Good show, old ass. You decided to pay tribute by dressing like a Nintendo 64 logo. Stupid ass boy. Uno draw four dressing ass. I bet when you looked in the mirror with that outfit on, you said, I'm about to change the game. Literally, stupid ass boy. I'm on your ass. This person should lose their job immediately. We don't say pay. Well, go ahead. I wait. Go ahead. Go ahead. Who is DJ D Red? Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say the same thing, bro. <laughs> DJ Devil ARP. <laughs> DJ my back. <laughs> DJ my knee. <laughs> DJ ah. <laughs> All right, world events that happened the year DJ D Rec was born. Oh. <laughs> what is he DJ the Boston Tea Party? <laughs> <laughs> what is uh, Juneteenth? What is the Big Bang? <laughs> All right. Your answer is signs that tell you he's broke. Uh, uh, woo, but you're fast. Uh, 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 you're fast. What is he still the DJ on Wild and Out? <laughs> oh. Your answer is ways people show their age without saying how old they are. What is DJ Wildin' Out for 17 seasons? And hosting. Your answer is excuses d Rec gives for still being on Wildin' Out. What is medical and dental benefits? <laughs> That's true. I don't know. It's good. It's good. What is then you'd actually have to learn how to DJ? Ooh! I'm gonna go ahead and push this button right here. Okay, let's move on. What is because you don't have no other friends? <laughs> or other jobs. All right, we're gonna move on. Shut up. So I can state the obvious. What is, this is the only job I have. <laughs> and I'm homeless. Don't put his business on TV. Nah, now. we got to. Y'all over here making us up be real. He sleeps at that DJ booth. Your answer is songs on DJ d Rex's favorite playlist. What is, I got the whole world <laughs> on my neck. What is Diglo? Cause you're Nick Cannon's bitch. <laughs> the crowd liked that one. What is, you'll never find <laughs> blum, 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 a friend <laughs> like mine. I like big heads and I cannot lie. <laughs> what is this old man? He play one, he play knickknack for What a knickknack, man, it was Yo, Emmanuel, 
We talking about side hustles. You know I got the bootleg J's and girls bundles. You got the bundles, man, that sounds fun. Can you hook me up with two? Cause my girl needs some. I said your girl needs some. Bro, I got what you need. Matter of fact, I'm selling some of Nick's old CDs. I'm cool on those, but I can tell you what I need. Friday's my favorite movie. I need one, two, and three. Hey, one, two, and three. For me, that ain't a struggle. But DJ d Rec really needs a side hustle. I was thinking the same thing. The Bell and Buzz has got to go. Nick Cannon, get your man on another show. Pick up and kill it and kill it and kill it. Oh. Pick up and kill it and kill it and kill it. Pick Your topic is balding. We just got balding. That is the best. The baldest one here is DJ d Rec. DJ d Rec, is that what you said? He looked like he left his hairline in the bed. Line in the bed? That's what you mean, fool. He left his hairline way back in preschool. Back in preschool? That's a fact. Hey, DJ d Rec, why don't you take off your hat? Hey. Take off your hat. My man, no, no, it ain't no bad question. It's real. You just real. You know, you you employ all of us, man. You know what I mean? Feed my family, black squad, take care, red squad, take care of y'all. You know what I mean? You employ that dude. My guy. Y'all cool? Loyalty, <laughs> 11 years. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> but if you had a choice, you either gotta fire DJ D Rick uh -huh. or cancel Wild and Out. Oh. <laughs> He's out of here. Ah! Goes. This, this old, old man, he play one, he, he play knick knack on. on. Ah, hey, DJ Khaled couldn't be here, so give it up for DJ D Rec. Drop the beat! This old man be spinning them hits. This old man still working for Nick. This old man can't get out the bed, cause this old man got a beat. DJ D Rex, ah, DJ D Rex, ah, DJ D Rex, ah, DJ D Rex, ah. See, he been here before, and I'm not even psyching. He can't even scratch a record, cause he got arthritis. Hey. This old man, this man right here, hairline go back 45 years. Ah. DJ D Rex, ah, ah. like 80 yards. Ah. He got babies that ah. came back from the graveyard. Ah. Chico, while out. Clap it up for him, y'all. Clap it up, clap it up. Four. Your final words are, if it ain't broke. If it ain't broke, it ain't DJ d Rec, because you are broke as hell. <laughs> DJ d Rec is so broken. DJ d Rec is so broke. He don't have any money. He don't have any money. Uh, you know what, uh, Nick Cannon, uh, I think it's cool what you're doing for DJ d Rec, man. I heard about what happened to him. He's getting sued, and uh, I heard that you were paying for all of the court costs. That's what's up for real good friend. Yes, I, like I said, he's getting sued uh, by his pillows. <laughs> it's not his fault. It's not his fault. He was diagnosed with a rare condition called e etositis. And uh, what that means is... Instead of when you eat food, swallowing down, you swallow up, and that causes his head to blow. Some of the symptoms that we, uh, <laughs> that they show, it, when he sneezes, he does a full front flip. <laughs> you had already spit, I need my bill. You didn't hear the bill? I ring your bill, big head ass. <laughs> the award goes to DJ d -Rec. That's me. Oh, oh, oh. I help him, help him out. Help. Is, is. 
<laughs> My head is not that I would good. like to thank, uh, thank y'all for the uh, Ahead of the Game Award. <laughs> and uh, I'm not gonna take up too much of your time. I just want to say uh, shout out to all my hats. Uh, I know we've been through a lot, and I know sometimes that could be much of a headache. Uh, <laughs> thank y'all for putting up with me. And most importantly, shout out to Nick Cannon, man, because without Nick, I wouldn't be a DJ. <laughs> I would just be a wreck. Thank y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, listen, while announce my only job, I know someone could tell. I can't DJ, but I can press a buzzer bell. I do it yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You going? Nick Cannon, I really can't stand him. You and D-Rec are a terrible tandem. D-Rec, this is TV. Why are you dressed like you coach P.E.? <laughs> You got on a red waist train, I ain't never seen that. Real talk, listen, and I mean that. Look, I'ma tell you, it looking scary. You look like a nasty ass strawberry. Strawberry. <laughs> <laughs> in the bottom of the bag. <laughs> when you bite it, you wish it you never had. I'm rapping on this beat with your bald headed ass. And you be hating over there because you really trash. And you ain't never hey. had no job. Hey. You hating on the red and the black squad. <laughs> Every time you wanna rap, <laughs> take a nap. <laughs> Cause I don't f with you. Nick, don't f with you. Listen, you like Clip Huxtable. Bull. You was good, but then your ass going back to the hood. Walking ass. Walking ass. Walking ass. Walking ass. Walkin ass. Walkin ass. Oh, oh. I think that was all about you, D-Rex. Thank you. Thank Get you. tired of this. Okay.